Hey guys, how's it going? It's a pretty unseasonably warm late fall day here. I mean, look at this. I'm in a t-shirt. It's about 50 degrees out here. It's disgusting. But we got an interesting project today. But judging by the wood, you're going to see that's another video. Upcoming that. <laughs> but for today, we have this helmet here I just bought from Amazon. It's like a um, uh, jet fighter helmet. It's got a, a little visor in here that that slides down. You know, like a Coast Guard helmet or something. But uh, I'm not a huge fan of the flat black. It's okay if you're riding a motorcycle or whatever, but I want to repaint it specifically to match the old girl that's underneath the tarp here. I really wanted a vintage helmet, but I can't afford the one I want. Those are like three, four hundred dollars if you could find one that fits. I got a big head. Unfortunately, it's not because I'm any smarter, but beside the point. So I'm going to go grab some sandpaper and we're going to start sanding her down and I'm going to start the repainting process. Okay. Whoa, I almost bit it. Any idea what color it's going to be yet? Colors, I should say. It's probably way too rough for what we're looking for, but whatever. Okay, not perfect, but a little better than it was. I'm gonna clean it off, whoops, real quick. Some uh, stuff here. Hopefully it won't melt anything. Okay. I'll let her dry. And then we're going to move to our spray booth. Okay. Now that the helmet's pretty much dry, we've relocated it to our spray booth, formerly known as a bird bath. Must have been a big bird or something that landed on it and busted it up. Okay, we'll uh, give it a little break and uh, come back, give her another coat. And, uh, see, see how she looks then? Well, it's a little tiny bit sticky, but I'm not pulling any paint up with my hands, so. Give her another coat. <laughs>
thinking maybe one more coat. The problem is, since it's December, or almost December, I'm losing light. And it's about 70 degrees out here, but I think it's starting to look pretty good. This is just color number one of three. Any guesses as to what uh, what this is going to look like yet? So uh, we'll come back on. I'll watch another episode of Monster Garage. <laughs> and uh, come back on. Check it out. Okay. Been about 30 minutes. It's not drying as fast as I would like because of the cold, but it's still drying. But it's tacky. It's not, uh, I'm not picking up any trace on my hands. So let's give her one final coat for the day. Pretty good. I just want to make it a little bit better. Less eggshell. That's enough for today. I'm gonna let this thing dry for a few hours. Got a little bit of runnage happening, but that's all right. It ain't going nowhere. Can touch it up tomorrow. So, with that, coat one. Okay, it's been 24 hours, and this is. It's got a slight tack to it, but nothing we're not gonna we're gonna proceed. I've taped it all up. Looks more like a mummy now. But uh, we're gonna go from speed racer to something a little bit cooler. So here's uh, step two. I'm gonna prep this by giving her a quick little sand and uh, get rid of some of the gloss and away we go. Okay, here we go. That's number two. Okay, now we let her dry. Hey, good morning guys. It's day, what, three? Anyways, <clears throat> I was up real late last night, so if I sound groggy or anything, that's why. Um, here's the helmet. I'd say it looks really darn good. All ready for its last color. I have a little bit of touch-up to do down here the white and some of the red. I accidentally scraped it against my deck, desk. But other than that, any ideas what it's going to look like? No, not the Pepsi bottle, the helmet. <laughs> so let's, uh, I'm gonna, I'm just going to go outside and paint it. You've seen somebody spray paint before and I'll come on with an update later. So, here we are. Got my stars cut out. Perfect. Okay, I got the first coat on. Oh yeah, it's dry as a phone. Not three. Yeah, it's got a little bit of me. Not as much as I would like though. It's not sticking the best. I should have sanded it a little bit. I didn't. Fire me. I don't know if that's going to stick. I think we're going to have a problem here shortly. So, Well, I got a second coat on, but I think I got to sand it. So we'll see. Well, if it's not one thing, it's another with this stupid helmet. Basically, the white didn't stick real well. 
so it's kind of been peeling itself off. I, uh, you know, basically I was just rubbing it off like this. So, let's see, I might have gotten it all. At least a big chunk of it. I mean, this is pathetic. The blue stuck okay, you know, some of it that, that where the white was really fully cured. I guess the white wasn't fully cured between coats or something. Okay, here it is. It's not perfect, of course. But that's the basis idea, basic idea. Now let's see how well our white trim strip stayed. Thank you.